Hello friends, in this lesson we shall learn how to find surface area of a cone. So what is this? Mmm, yummy ice cream cone. Don't you feel sometimes we should just forget maths and just eat this ice cream? I know, I am also feeling just like you. Let's find out the surface area and then we'll eat this ice cream. Okay, so let's find the surface area of this cone. So a cone is represented by three parameters. One is the radius of the base of the cone. So this is the radius of the base. This is the circular area of the cone. This is the circular face of this cone. So this radius is one aspect of this cone. I will draw the cone here. So I'm not great in the drawing, but you can see I have drawn the same cone here. So this is the radius of this cone. Okay. And this is the other circular face of this cone. Right? Which is this. So the height of this cone, the vertical height of this cone from top to bottom or let me just put it on the side so you can get get a little sense of it this is the height of the cone how tall the cone is so it in case of cone this is called the height which is of this case like an imaginary line passing from this tip going to the base of the cone perpendicular to the base of this cone. So this is that height of this cone. And the third parameter is called the slanting height of this cone, which is this thing, which is of this slanting portion, this portion. And this is represented by L. So a cone is represented using three parameters, the radius of the circular base, the height of the cone and the slanting height of the cone which is L. So now we need to find the surface area of this cone, right? How do we find it? Let's start. First we'll try to find the simpler part of it which is this part of the cone which is very easy. You can see it's a two-dimensional portion which is circle and we know the area of the circle is pi r square. So at least we were able to find the area of this face of the cone which is pi r square. Now let's try to find the area of the circular part. This is the one, right? Let's try to find this. This will become the total surface area of the cone. This area plus this area. This is simple pi r square area of the circle which is this and this the second part which is the area of this portion we will calculate in the next video. Let's do that.